Good morning guys, welcome back. Today is going to be an extremely busy and special day. Both of my sisters are getting engaged. Not today, <laughs> but I just can't believe it. Within the last year, everything just kind of lined up perfectly, subhanAllah, and they met really, really good guys and everything's just kind of been progressing and all the families have been like on board and we're gonna be doing their fatihas a week apart. Amanda's Fatiha is tonight and then Lauren's is next Friday. So if you guys don't know what a Fatiha is, it's basically an event where the groom's family comes over to the bride's family and basically like asks for her hand and basically both families kind of give the blessing that they are okay with both of their children like getting to know each other and that they're going to get engaged and married in the future. So it's kind of like that first step to getting engaged and married. So it's a really, really special event. For Omar and I's Fatiha, it was a really like small, intimate gathering at my house. It was just Omar's family and just my family. It was really small. Some families do it differently though, where they bring like a whole bunch of people and like all their friends. Some people even do it in like a hall, like as if it was like an engagement party. Every family is different. So Amanda's future fiance, Muhammad, his family does like really big events for this stuff. So they're bringing like a whole bunch of people to our house. So of course we had to have all of our friends over at our house. So it's just become this huge big thing at our house, not my house, at my parents' house. <laughs> so this is gonna be so much fun. I'm so, so happy for both of my sisters and I'm just, alhamdulillah, so excited for them and may Allah bless both of their relationships forever and ever and ever. So today's going to be a super busy day for me just because I have to do Amanda's makeup, take her pictures, and then, you guys, I have to work. Like, oh, I'm so upset about that. Basically, the reason I have to work is because, okay, I got the opportunity to go to Dubai the second week of January, and I'm so super excited about that. Omar wasn't able to go because it was super last minute and he wasn't able to switch his schedule. So I'm taking Amanda with me and we're gonna have so much fun, inshallah. Um, but since it was super last minute, I did have to like work really hard to like move my schedule around in order, in order for me to go. And this one coworker of mine, she called me and she was like, Lena, I will take one of your days that you need off for Dubai if you work from 3 p.m. to 7 p.m. on December 22nd. And that was Amanda's Fatiha day and I was just like, oh my god, like what am I gonna do? How am I gonna make this work? Like I can't miss that event, you know, but then again, I don't want to miss Dubai either So I was literally on the verge of like quitting my job. Not really, but I just did not want to be Having to deal with all of that. So I decided to just go ahead and work three to seven I'll just be late to her Fatiha, but hopefully I'll just miss dinner I'm not gonna actually miss the actual event. So I'm gonna be doing her makeup, going doing her pictures, getting ready for work, running to work, working for for four hours, then coming back home, getting dressed really fast, and then going to the Fatiha. So I'm gonna try to vlog as much as I can today. I went ahead and I did my like face makeup just so that I have that done so that whenever I come back home to like throw on my eye makeup and stuff, it doesn't take me as long. I'm gonna be trying to vlog Amanda's Fatiha and then Lauren's Fatiha as well. Hers is next week. It's just crazy that it happened like so close together. Amanda's also going to be vlogging as well so you can go and like re- She's calling me. <laughs> Okay, I want to show you guys what outfit I'm wearing tonight for her Fatiha. So this is a dress by BCBG. It's this beautiful midi dress in this cream color. I'm going to be wearing some um, black straight leg trousers underneath and some black heels. But I'm just absolutely obsessed. It's so elegant. You guys aren't going to be able to really see what it looks like until I have it completely on. But I love the sleeves and like the shape of it is just stunning. So my dressing room is a little bit of a mess right now, but I have a little update. So I got a new chair. I got this from Overstock. I'll link it down below. I'm going to be doing a full dressing room tour once I have everything in. And I also ordered this new rug. I'm just so obsessed. I have some of my makeup set out just in case Amanda does need me to do her makeup. And I just thought these palettes were absolutely gorgeous. This is another one from Laura Mercier. This is the Nightlights Eye and Cheek Collection. It's just absolutely stunning. I thought this would be gorgeous on Amanda's lids. She just wants something super simple. So I'll probably just do like a light um, something in the crease and then a little highlight on the lids. Another thing that I've been absolutely obsessed with is this gloss by Laura Mercier. So at this point, I'm basically just waiting for Amanda to get here and then we'll go take her pictures and then I will go run to work and I'm going to try to vlog it all. <laughs> Yay! Look who just 
we've got here. And look who's in their scrubs now. <laughs> <laughs> I changed so that I can be ready to go to work as soon as we finish taking pictures. So, okay. So you want just like a simple. Yeah, like, I just, just want something in the crease, and then like. Yeah. Do you want shimmer on the legs? Yeah, we can do shimmer. Please close. I'm putting a blue shadow all over your legs. That was a joke. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, okay. <laughs> 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 She got a thobe from Jordan. Yes. Didn't and um, your future fiance Mohammed's dad just got it for you. Yes. He did so good. It's no. so beautiful, Mashallah. There's I love another it. Another belt that goes on top of this one. Okay, let me help you. Oh, pretty. Yeah, that's my tangle. So nice. It's okay. Okay. So pretty. Okay. So gorgeous, Mashallah. I love that. Show me your makeup. So I just did a really super simple neutral eye just because she never really wears makeup. Yeah, I just don't wear a lot of eyeshadow. I haven't worn eyeshadow. That's so forever. pretty on you though. It's so natural. I, still I love need to put it. My lipstick on, but yeah. Okay, we'll do that in the car. And your hair looks really pretty. Oh, I'm curled it for me. Oh, I love it. So pretty. Okay, let's go. Okay. Muhammad, are you okay with being on my vlog? <laughs> I'm like shoving the camera in your face. Hold on. Um Oh, okay. Perfect. <laughs> Forgot the tag. So we are here at this beautiful church that I used to always take pictures for my vlog and I thought this would be a beautiful place for them to take some just like portrait shots since they don't have any good pictures together. I just parked, I'm at work a little bit early, and I'm not going in there until exactly three o'clock. <laughs> I'm just so sad, I just like don't wanna be here right now. I wanna be with my family, I wanna be helping them, getting ready for the party. I wanna be with Omar, like it just sucks. A lot of you guys always ask me like how, how do I balance like being a blogger, being a nurse, being a wife, like working out and eating healthy. Like to be honest, like I don't, like I don't think anybody is humanly capable of like that many things. Something is going to suffer and for me, it has been my friends. I haven't seen my friends in so long and working out recently, I have not been going to yoga or doing any of the stuff that I want to do. I haven't been to yoga since before Morocco. I truly do love my job as a nurse and I'm so thankful that I only have to work like once or twice a week so that I can also fit in my blogging stuff, but it does get super, super hard to balance it, especially on occasions like this whenever it's like a really, really special occasion and here I am having to be like at work. <sighs> I guess that is just life. Nothing is ever perfect and I'm not gonna always get my way. <laughs> okay, just got to our little break room. I'm about to sign in on the computer. I just got to work, clocked in, got my badge, got my stethoscope. You guys always wanted me to vlog at work and here I am on the worst possible day ever. <laughs> but um, I'm probably not gonna be able to vlog anything else other than the break room. So I will see you guys when I finish. Okay, I'm walking back to my car, finally off work. It took me like 30 more minutes than normal to like give report and everything. So I'm super, super late. So I'm gonna rush home, get ready, and then finally be at the party with my family. All right guys, I am rushing out the door, but I wanted to show you guys my outfit really fast. How gorgeous is this dress by BCBG? I told you guys it looked so much better on. I love the sleeves. I love this little, um, 
I don't even know what you would call it, flowy part on the bottom. And I'm just wearing some um, straight leg pants and some black heels with it. I just threw on some eyeliner and mascara and some lipstick and I am gonna be headed out the door and I will see you guys at the party. <laughs> Muhammad,